Pretty Little Lies star Lucy Hale is telling her truth. The 33-year-old actress spoke emotionally out about her addiction to alcohol and how she navigated her inner demons during a tell-all podcast interview. Hale confessed she started binge drinking at the age of 14 and revealed she had many moments where she thought she had hit her emotional rock bottoms. Dozens, and that's why it was so hard because I'm like oh, I thought we went to the depths of hell. How could it be worse? She said during an appearance on the Diary of a CEO podcast. Lucy Hale explains her dating non-negotiables, why she often prefers older men. Lucy Hale emotionally spoke out about her alcoholism and how she navigated her inner demons during a tell-all podcast interview. Lucy Hale emotionally spoke out about her alcoholism and how she navigated her inner demons during a tell-all podcast interview. YouTube During the candid one-hour, 30-minute podcast interview, Hale admitted she would drink until she couldn't remember anything. Lucy Hale confessed she started binge drinking at the age of 14 and revealed she had many moments where she thought she had hit her emotional rock bottoms. Lucy Hale confessed she started binge drinking at the age of 14 and revealed she had many moments where she thought she had hit her emotional rock bottoms. Getty Images I have never talked publicly about being sober. I have a little over a year of sobriety, Hale said. Lucy Hale reportedly threatens to sue website for posting her private photos. I have been working on getting sober since I was 20. I'm 33. It took time. It took patience with myself. Lucy Hale is known for her role on Pretty Little Liars, which premiered in 2010 and continued for seven seasons. Lucy Hale is known for her role on Pretty Little Liars, which premiered in 2010 and continued for seven seasons. Getty Images I was a textbook binge drinker. Blackout I wouldn't remember what I did or what I said, which was scary, she remarked. Hale added that she thought drinking would help her embody her truest self and that she felt so much funnier and cooler. That's all bulls, she discovered. Not true, I was not myself, not my truest self. She continued to say it was difficult to be a moderate drinker, and she always went to a dark place. Despite having a strong support system, Hale pointed out that nobody could convince her not to drink until she was able to make the realization for herself. I tried to change for boyfriends. I tried to change for my mom. I tried to change for my career. I tried to change for vain reasons. I'll look younger and look skinnier. I'll stop drinking for that. One of my best friends died of alcoholism and that still didn't make me want to get sober, Hale told the media outlet. None of that s works. I had to and wanted to get sober January 2, 2022, because I said, I deserve more. I deserve more out of this life. I have to try it a different way, and I have to be willing to commit to it. She additionally opened up about her eating disorder, relationships, and what she hopes for in the next chapter of her life. On Valentine's Day, the Hating Game star also took to her INSTagram to celebrate one year of sobriety. Hale shared a photo of a cake with sprinkles on top that said one year. On January 2, 2023, I celebrated one year of sobriety, she wrote in part. While this journey has mostly been private, I felt compelled tonight to let anyone who is struggling know that you are not alone and you are loved. Fans may recognize Hale from her most popular role on Pretty Little Liars, which premiered in 2010 and aired for seven seasons. Stephanie Jongpanen is an entertainment writer for Fox News Digital. Story tips can be sent to stephanie.jong at fox.com and on Twitter at Skyongpanen.